Hey, buddy. I got $100 I need you to hold on to. Do not give it to anybody. Not even Bob. Sure as hell, not Tom. Hold on to it. Not even me. Don't let me come back and get it. I need you, yet yeah, you, to hold on to it. Yeah, so it's really important that you hold on to this. All right. Thanks, buddy. Hey, what's up, buddy? Um, you remember that, um, the money I gave you yesterday? Yeah, I, I need you to give me that back. I know, ha <laughs> good, you're smart, you're smart. I just need you to give it back. I need you to give me the money back. It was my money, I gave it to you, give it back to me. Give me the money back. Give me the money. Give me the money! What's going on? My name is Cole Connor. I'm an artist and entrepreneur. And today I want to tell you, talk to you about how I saved my first $1,000 and how you can too. Let's do it. What's going on? My name is Cole Connor. I'm an artist and entrepreneur and I was put here to do two things, create and inspire. Thanks for being here. Let's get into it. I have finally, for the first time in my life, saved $1,000 and I am incredibly stoked about it. I've had some really good and some really bad years as an entrepreneur. No matter how much I've brought in, I don't find myself saving. It always went into a new investment and not the best kinds. There are three main things that helped me to save this. Two things I stopped doing, one thing I started doing. And all are assuming that you make more than your basic needs to survive because if you don't, then you're gonna even out every month, obviously. I am not a financial advisor in any way. These are things that just worked out for me. I'm saying that because every other YouTuber that talks about stuff like this says it. And I don't know why they say it, but maybe I should say it too, so I'm saying it. First thing, I stopped reinvesting every cent back into my business unnecessarily. As an entrepreneur, anyone who doesn't have a structured, stable sal salary, times will be good, but that doesn't mean they'll always be good. Some months you make $10,000, but the next month, you might make $2,000. So don't invest in a $4,000 computer on the month that you make 10,000 just because you want the newest and the best one. Have I done that? Maybe I have, you'll never know. Spend your funds wisely or in fact, just don't spend them at all. Invest them in the stock market or just have them collect dust somewhere before throwing them away for some new shiny object that Apple has to offer. Damn you, Apple. Just kidding, don't do that. Put them in the stock market, put them in crypto, have, put in your emergency fund, do it. For me, when I got a rush of business, I felt unstoppable. I felt like it was the beginning of a money parade and everyone was gonna throw money at me because Cole is a money making money, money make machine and his business is the best business in the world and it's never gonna stop till the end of time. My mind would immediately rush to all the things that I needed to buy and do to make my business go from 10,000 a month to 20,000 a month. I was always thinking about the next phase of my business, which, you know, is good, kind of. I mean, it's good in general have that mindset but for what i did real estate photo video and youtube life it just looked like spending a bunch of money on equipment and studio stuff the reality is i could have spent a hundred thousand dollars on equipment and still bought more it would have been much smarter for me to just save the additional funds funds keep my credit score high and look for ways that i can protect and expand my fiscal blueprint not my cool vibey studio. When I'm saying to you that it's not worth your financial health to invest in new things prematurely, trust me on that one. Immediately buys the Apple Watch when it drops. Immediately saving for the new iMac or the MacBook Pro with the M1 chip. Or the PS4. Second thing, I stopped outsourcing every single task to subcontractors. Just don't move too fast with that. When I started to think about saving and why I particularly struggled with it, even when I started to make, you know, 15, 16, 17,000 dollars a month, I couldn't help but think what has changed with my situation. What's up? You're not doing your video, are you? Me doing a video? No. Yeah. I went from running a team of people to being a solopreneur. This changed everything for me. I realized that much like equipment, I invested in subcontractors and my team way, 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 way too much and way too soon. I should have waited another two years minimum. If I would have done that, I would have been able to save honestly $40,000. My credit wouldn't have been terrible. My savings would look great. I probably would have learned more about stocks and crypto early on. I may be a millionaire. I remember the thought was to free up my mind and allow me to create the content that I want to create. That's why I hired so many people, to do all the work. Ha, no, I ended up doing all the work double because you have to train people and people don't do what they're supposed to do and people don't take 
you know, steps themselves and you gotta do it all. Plus you gotta be free to create the content you want. Hey, no, okay, honestly, I did a little. I had more time to create, yes. But it wasn't worth them the amount of headache and stress that the team caused me. Just not worth it. For me, I learned from these mistakes and hopefully I won't make them again. Now I'm so focused on becoming financially healthy that I may be a money minimalist before you know it. Probably not. Last thing I did was I started using Acorns. If you haven't heard of Acorns, Acorns is an app that you can download from the App Store and it really changed the game for me. As you can probably tell, I really haven't always been the best with money. I tend to spend what I have, stay on the go, and live by the words, well, let's just make more money. That's why downloading Acorns really helped me out. And no, Acorns is not sponsoring this video. I just use them and it's how I save my first thousand bucks, honestly. I'm not gonna give you some full in-depth review of Acorns and everything they offer and everything they do. I'm just gonna tell you what I do and what I did. I did see that Logan Alec, I believe, had a really good full review and I think he's an accountant. Um, I didn't watch the whole thing, but I watched some of it. Seems like he knows, knows what he's talking about. So you can check that out if you want like a full in-depth review of the actual application. But here's the here are the features that I found most helpful. Investing your spare change. So I do, for example, go to a coffee shop every day and every day I have spare change. So what Acorns did was they collected all of my spare change when I spent, let's say, if I spend 550 at the coffee shop, it takes that 50 cents to round up to six dollars yeah so it takes that 50 cents that's you know six dollars minus 550 that 50 cents and it compiles it into its app once my spare change reaches five to ten dollars it deposits it into my savings account that was a really cool feature because you don't think about how much spare change you're adding up and it doesn't really make that big of a difference per transaction to go from 420 to 5 580 to 6 or 29.30 to 30. It only is a couple cents per time, but as each transaction that you make, if you make 10 transactions a day, you know, it adds up 10 bucks a day, five bucks a day. You know, even if you make one transaction a day, it all adds up. That really helped me. I didn't have to look at it. I didn't have to think about it. It just invested that spare change into my savings account for me. That was pretty cool investing the spare change that's the feature the second thing was just investing weekly there were weeks that i made less money and weeks that i made more money when i knew that i was making a lot more money i did switch this around a little bit to where i was starting to invest you know 50 bucks a week 100 bucks a week into my acorns account what they allow you to do is do i think as low as five dollars weekly so if you know you're not like you're kind of making a stable income and you can only dedicate ten dollars a week into your savings emergency fund, then just do that. You set it up on the app and $10 a week will come out of your account, whichever day you pick weekly, you don't have to think about it. You just let it happen and then you check it. And then when you add up the weekly investments that you've made in the spare change, you start to see it grow. The last thing that I thought was pretty cool about Acorns was that you can choose to invest into in a portfolio of like stocks through the Acorns app. And you can choose to be um, moderately aggressive, not very aggressive, super aggressive. So pretty much they invest the money for you, but it no matter what, it's not super risky because I put it on aggressive mode because I was like, let's just see what's gonna happen here. And through that, at the with the thousand dollars that I've you know put in over the past uh, four months, I've collected a dollar thirty in dividends, which isn't a lot, but it's something. And the market has blessed me with twenty two dollars and ninety three cents worth of returns. So on top of the spare chains, on top of the weekly, I've also made twenty two dollars just from where they invested. Because this is not a very volatile portfolio, there's not a lot of movement going on. Um, I've shown over the past four months that it's just slow gains. This is what I consider my savings account. I don't like for money to sit still at all. I don't like money to collect dust. It's not something that I've ever done and it's not something I'll probably will ever do. So this was like the most dust that my money is going to collect, but it's still collected $22.93 in returns in uh, my acorns portfolio because i have it on set as the most aggressive that you can set one other kind of cool thing that they do is that it shows you invest projections so if you keep investing what you have now it gives you like this whole chart and you can see how that will change over time and i think like if i do 
it showed me at one point like a hundred dollars a week was just some crazy large number by the time I'm like 60 or something like that, which, you know, makes sense if you continually do it for 30 years. Of course, it's going to be a lot, but it was kind of cool to see what that big number was. They have tons of other features. I pay $1 a month for the features that I have. I think it's definitely worth it because you're not thinking about the portfolio. You're not thinking about the weekly investments. You don't have to think about the spare change. It does it all for you. You're creating a savings account without having to really try that hard and you actually can grow from it and collect dividends and stuff like that. They also have Acorns Later and Acorns Spend. Acorns Later, Acorns Spend Smarter. They have all these other features. Like I said, you can check out that one guy's video if you wanna see all the specifics of the features. I'm gonna be looking more into them. They also have a lot of rewards and coupons for big brands like Nike. So there's a lot of like little things that can help you save a little bit of money and just build that emergency fund savings account or use it for, I mean, use it however you want, but I like to use it as an emergency fund savings account. That's that's what I'm building it for. If you invite three friends, this is the promotion they have going on currently. I'm sure it changes like with the amount of friends and all that stuff. But right now, if you invite three friends and they join, you receive monetary gains. So if you want to join, here's my affiliate link. I've got it in the description. Click that, check it out. If you like it, use it. If you don't, don't. This is what worked for me. This is how I was able to save my first thousand dollars at 28 years old. If you are a reckless spender, if you're financially unhealthy, this can really help to get you. This can really help to get you in the green, feeling solid and not stressed out and not worried about your money all the time. And if you use the affiliate link, you're just helping support me and support my channel and putting out this content. You will not regret it. If you like what I'm doing, please like and subscribe. I'm trying to raise the subscriber amount, trying to get this thing to a thousand subscribers as soon as possible. So yeah, the link is in the description. Like, subscribe, do all that jazz. If there's anything else I can help you with, let me know, leave a comment. I'll catch y'all later. Every day I wake up with a vision Cooking in the kitchen, ain't no fucking in a mission Like yo, shaking up the city with my bitchin' Sold in the building and the motherfucker fizzin' Like whoa, cold won't stop till you get that gold Cold won't stop till you sing my song